Artificial intelligence, or AI, is creating confusion as people try to follow what's happening in the war in Israel and Gaza from afar. 69 News reporter Priscilla Ligori has more on that. As the Israel-Hamas war rages on, images continue to flood social media. Propaganda, misinformation, disinformation has been around for a very long time. It's just that AI has given us tools now to do a much bigger, much better job. You have Midjourney, you have Dally 3, and you have Stable Diffusion which are the three image generators that people are using. New artificial intelligence tools are being used to share images that aren't real, that then get reshared over and over again. The quality has gotten so much better. Anybody can use this tool and it's free. For example, it took Lehigh professor Daniel Lepresti only 15 seconds to generate this. I asked for an image of President George Washington playing basketball. We know that basketball wasn't invented until 1891, and George Washington died in 1799, so there's no way this is an authentic image. Although if you zoom in, you really can't see the flaws in this image. So how can you tell what is real? Right now, it's tough. There's going to be mechanisms to tell if it's real or fake, but those mechanisms haven't necessarily come out yet. I think critical thinking, skepticism, what you see, um, look for confirmation. So if you see it in one place, but you don't see it anywhere else, and it looks like a big influential image, um, that might be a sign that it's not real, that it's somehow fake or appropriated from some other source. Um, and just look for trustworthy media. Another huge problem is images being recycled, maybe from the same area or other parts of the world, years later with misleading captions. For that, you can do a reverse image search on a search engine to see if it's an old picture resurfaced. Priscilla Ligori, 69 News.